Most people in America are concerned with how do I keep myself safe? Personal safety, personal protection, self-protection were seminars I once traded and taught in my community. I did this all before I went off to learn Japanese in Japan. But what I can tell you about personal protection today is that we are way behind in understanding how naive men and women of the Midwest are with regard to the companies, the employees, the Chinese, the Koreans, the Muslims, the Indians, the Hindis who are coming to America with skill sets and talents that we didn't expect. I'm not talking about professional skill sets we employ. I'm talking about the technology they are training every girl and boy with on how to hack our phones, ruin our computers, and destroy our chemistry of our bodies. I don't like knowing that the military for the longest time, based on the films we've seen coming out of Hollywood, have had a pitch that they can play on people to shut them down, turn them off, or literally make them do things to each other. We have to be very careful about the inaudible realms of our ears. While some people are thinking, other people are hearing, but whether or not you're truly listening, that's on your life. We are in a time when people like to play predator games, and a predator game takes a human being and turns them into a toy or a game board, like operation, and that is not okay. We have Muslims in our jails, working in them, ruining our records, interfering with our insurance, forwarding our mail, destroying our bodies, taking away our rights to our human dignities and health, and we've got white women, all named Teresa there, who literally think they have rights to participate in the abatement of their jobs. When a physician orders a product, that product is supposed to be delivered. If the fucking nurse doesn't know how to do it, she should allow the patient who's done it his whole fucking life do it. But they are so fearful of anyone who's there legitimately, meaning they didn't actually get to jail based on some bad behavior, and that is hard for them to get, because they're not accustomed to that. But what I'm telling you is that companies like CCS and others who employ nurses are ruining our HIPAA laws, destroying our privacy, and abating, literally just obliterating our medical rights. And at this time, I'm going to plan to sue every fucking employee personally for abusing my rights to my privacy. In America, we have security for the president. In America, we have safety for our people. But when a security expert, an ex-secret service agent, doesn't get that her best bet is to focus on teaching safety in America, we really have lost ourselves. In life, we have moments of time to speak the truth and speak what we know. But your truth for you and your family is yours. My truth for me and my family is mine. Do not interfere with another person's property. Do not interfere with another person's possessions. Do not interfere with another person's paperwork. And do not interfere with another person's right to their human body in personhood.